Right, we're off to Shepstow for race one on day three of week nine. One is Cuban Mananen for David Robson, two Perfect Storm, Obi Wan, three Vlaw, Michael Scala, four Arabian Knight, Patrick Hogan, five is Steamboat, Sally Pontpool Racing, six is Whiskey Dax, Stu Gray, seven Monsanto, Monica Emerald for Vinnie Gerald, eight is Court Minstrel, Graham Clatterbuck, nine is Indigo Blue, ten is Piage for Michael Scala, eleven Art and Classic, Satyam, 12 is Walter Privilege for Kevin Minigan, uh, 13 Common Deeding for Satyam, 14 for Brick Belgique, Martin Eden, 15 Truism, Sierra James Shea, 16 Quant Broker, Ben Benici, and 17 is Katya Hate for Thomas Rogers at the start. And away they go. A good break by most. Uh, the Graham Cloudback also got away really well. It was caught minstrel, but it's for Big Bodgy, got a flyer. But now Obi Wan's Perfect Storm has moved forward to take it up. So Obi Wan, the American challenge, and there's yellow colours, moves forward to lead them from second. Katia Pate for Thomas Rogers up the rail floor for Michael Schuyler. The blue and purple stripe of David Robertson's Cuban Mananum. On that one's inside is Santa Monica Emerald in the green colours. Just behind that is uh, Tourism Sierra. Then comes Arabian Night for Patrick Hogan. Out wide is Court Pencil for Graham Clutterbuck, the two Satyam horses together, Hot and Classic and Comet Deeding, Whisker Duck has been pushed along up the inside, Ben Benich is Quint Broker just behind that, then comes for Big Belty for Mark Needham, who's dropped back off to their good start, just ahead of that is Indigo Blue, Pierce is very wide, but it doesn't really matter at uh, Chepstow if they go wide, and Walter Privilege at the back of the field. So Perfect Storm takes them along, the yellow colours throw three lanes clear of Santa Monica Emerald in second, then comes Steamboat Sally for Graham Clutterbuck, Blows up the inside, uh, Cuban and Adam in three wide, then uh, Katia Pate for Thomas Rogers and that one's inside is Truism Sierra for James Shea then Arabian Knight for uh, Patrick Hogan just behind it the similar colours hot and classic for uh, Satyam out wide is accommodating in the same colours for Satyam and Piage is moving forward very stylishly up the outside the leader is still perfect storm Stain by Sally is uh, just behind that then comes Vlor for uh, Michael Sala but Piage is travelling really well out wide also running on his, his whiskey duck it's perfect storm kicks again from the front, Piage is travelling strongly up the outside, uh, running on strongly is a whiskey duck, also trying to get going, he's comatidic and hot and classic but it's still perfect storm for start Obi-Wan is trying to hold on from his fast finishing, Piers up the outside and Piers looks a lovely challenger to perfect storm, running on from the back Arabian night for Patrick Owen, but Piers now starts to assert close home and Michael Scala is going to win the handicap the first day, Michael Scala wins the handicap with Piers, whiskey duck finishing strongly with comatidic, but Piers Piers wins very comfy, hard held up front. Piers wins that for Michael Scala. Very close for second between Whiskey Dak and Comet Deeding. Well, that was an impressive winner. Came from last, went wide, wins it hard held from Whiskey Dak back in second. For Stu Gray, Comet Deeding was in third place for Satyam. Truism Sierra never dangerous fourth for James Shea. Santi when the Emerald threatened but never really moved forward with the challenge for Vinnie Gerald and Steamboat Sally for Graham Clutterback was but we were on pace in the finishing back in sixth place.